Yo, what's going on guys? I'm back with another video and today I'm on Atrix where I'll be hosting a giveaway. On the first place there will be 600 redeems, on the second place you will get 5 super donated boxes and on the third place you, got, you will get 5 regular donated boxes. All you do have to do to enter is make sure to leave a like on the video, make sure you are subscribed, turn on notifications and comment your in-game name down below and the winner will be picked in approximately 2 days from this video. Anyways, let's get into the video. Yo, what's going on guys? I'm back with another video and today I'm on Atrix. Now, as you can see, this is another 667 server, and this is a custom 667 server. There are a bunch of custom items on the server, which I'll showcase as well in this video. But I'm um, starting off at the home area. As you can see, the home area is located in Edgeville. You have the well right here where you can uh, give some money to for the well of goodwill. Um, then you have a few shops, of course, the PVM shop, which you can spend PVM tickets at, as you can, uh, boss points at my bed, and then you have the PVM ticket shop right here, where you can buy a bunch of really cool items. You can get PVM tickets from um, PVMing, obviously. Um, then right here you have the combat shop and then the sell your loot shop. As you can see, the combat shop has magic range and uh, mage armor. Uh, skill cape settings, rune shop, then a battle master Lucian to teleport to the Lucian boss, which I'll showcase real quick. Um, now the Lucian boss is however located in a PvP zone, so unlike me you are better off going without armor and um, not be retarded like how I, I am doing right now. But um, anyways, once you are here, you can actually examine the boss and see the loots that it drops. Uh, <coughs> as you can see it can drop the mystery box boss, it can drop PVM tickets, Dragon Warhammer, Lucian wings. Um, it can also drop upgrade crystals, Calphite helm. Um, Calphite body and Calphite legs, so that's some really nice armor that you can get from um, the uh, Lucian boss. Now for the rest of the home area and the bank area, you also have um, right here, you have the sell your loot store, you have the vote sto shop, which you can uh, check out for some boxes right here that you can get some other cosmetics as well. Then right here you have the trivia shop, where you can get yourself some Torva, you can get a purple, pur purple dildo, some katanas. Uh, some other third age, then you can get, uh, check the PvP coin shop where you can buy yourself some tropical torva. You can buy um, dust demon horn boots, dragon bone mage armor, an Atrix crossbow, which is really cool. However, this does cost 30 million PvP coins, which is quite a lot. You can get an abyssal dagger right here, some elite void. You can also get a dragon bone ring, so yeah, you can get a bunch of cool items here. Then you have the donated shop, so you can get the uh, you can check the second store right here. This is where you can spend redeems. By the way, you can also check the redeem store uh, one here, where you can get yourself a donator rank, super donator rank, or um, extreme donator rank, and a bunch of other really cool items. Then here you have the summoning uh, the Slayer task, which you can uh, get a Slayer task from, and you can also teleport to your task, which is very freaking nice. You can also trade it, of course, to check the rewards that you can get. You can get a Slayer box right here, um, a Slayer's shield tier 1, which you can then upgrade, and a Slayer armor, but you do need 99 Slayer for the armor. Then right here you have a treasure chest, but you do need a bloody key to actually open this chest. And here you have another treasure chest, but you do need 25 tickets, which you can get from PVMing randomly. Um, and then you can actually open up that chest. Here you have the penguins, which you can kill for damage tokens. Once you get damage tokens, you can actually talk to the damage master and unlock the damage shop. I do not have this yet, but it will cost you 1 million. Oh wait, what? Oh, you can actually open the shop without buying it. But as you can see, you do need a lot of um, damage tokens to actually buy stuff here. But you can upgrade your multiplier, which will make you do more damage on the penguins. And that will result you in getting more damage tokens per hour. So that's very nice. Then you have some basic thieving stalls here to train your thieving. You have an estate agent right here, which you can uh, use to actually build your house and train up construction which is very nice now i kind of did forget to mention that atrix is actually a brand new rsps it has released just a few days ago and as you can see it already has 15 players online which is pretty nice and these are all legit players as you can see right there there's also the player panel where you can check yourself uh, where you can check some information about your account how many players are online and stuff then right here you have a portal which has a bunch of teleports you can go to the mini games like Dicing Zone, Penguins, uh, Castle Looting, which is in the wilderness, PvP Teleports, High Risk Arena, Non-Prot Arena, which is very nice. Uh, then you have a few PvM Teleports, Megatron, which I'll go to in a second, um, Glacorge, Dinko, Slayer Dungeons, Tormented Demons, Slayer Task, Bosses, 
um, man which is a starter zone I'll just go to here real quick now man is a very good way to start in the beginning as you can see you can just examine it um, you can get some basic coins right here and a few of these boxes which I'll open in a second as well you can also get if uh, a star wings right here and as you can see from the drops that are left behind here you can also get upgrade tokens and PVM tickets just from these, as you can see, this is the standard drop from one of the men if you do not get a box. Besides that, let's have a look at the Megatron real quick. As you can see, the Megatron is uh, in the wilderness. It's basically Blink, but it's renamed. Uh, and you can get a Megatron Rapier, Chaotic Longsword, and Powered, which is a stronger version. Mystery boxes, you can also get a bloody key right here to open up the chest at home, so that's very nice as well. Now of course we cannot forget the most important part which is actually the bosses themselves. You have a bunch of cool bosses that are custom to the server. Of course you have the regular bosses like God Wars, Evil Chicken, Jad, Obsidian boss is more like a custom boss. You also have Sunfried, um, Nomadian boss, Man boss which I'll show in a second as well. Uh, Avatar of Destruction, then you have Atrix boss which is one of the um, custom bosses. And you also have Atrix God which is Lucian. Um, you can also talk to Lucian right there in the south of Edgeville. Uh, to go to Lucian, that's the boss that I showed earlier on. Um, besides that, you also have Corporal Beast and a Ganodermic boss, which I'll teleport to right now. Um, but as you can see, the Ganodermic boss, I have no idea if it's here. Um, I suppose it's the other way around. Uh, I think it's just Ganodermic Beast himself that can drop all this stuff. Um, oh, they actually can drop Assassin, which is pretty nice. I don't know if the, if the boss itself is super hard, but um, I think it does have quite a lot of HP. So yeah, it doesn't do a lot of damage. You can basically just pray melee and AFK here. But um, yeah, it does have quite a lot of HP. Now moving on, I will be showing some of the custom bosses as well. Now first, something that I'm interesting, uh, interested in myself is the man boss, because I don't know what I have to think about that. But as you can see in the wilderness, I think it's just a man with a lot of HP and it can also drop a bloody key, donate the box, mystery boxes like that. So um, yeah, that's pretty nice as well here. Anyways, moving on, there will be three more bosses that I'll be showing off, starting off with the obsidian bo boss because I have no idea which boss that is. Um, so, oh, you actually get teleported to a pretty cool island here, which looks fairly nice. Genji is killing it if we examine it. Oh, you need a 99 slayer level to actually fight this boss. Um, okay, that sucks. I will not be able to get loot from it, but it's it looks pretty cool and the island itself is really nice as well. So yeah, that's fairly cool. Moving on, we'll go to the Atrix boss. Now this boss is quite nice as well. Um, it's basically just a uh, Ice Torva guy with wings and a brutal whip that will wreck you pretty much instantly. But um, yeah, it can drop um, eternal wings, which look pretty cool, I guess. Um, these are, that are those white wings that you can see there. Um, and it can drop a bunch of boxes as well. And then, of course, the Torva, Virtus, and um, Pernix Atrix, which is really good. It can also drop a Gold Short Bow Light, which is very strong. Um, oh, Center Rocks just got a Blue Pipe. Very nice. But anyways, let's move on to the last boss, which is the Atrix God. Now, the Atrix God is basically a Lucian. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I already showcased this boss earlier. Um, but yeah, it can drop a bunch of cool items like the Lucian Wings, which are the wings that I'm equipping right now, by the way. I didn't mention that yet. But um, yeah, anyways, let's go to the bank real quick and uh, let's show some of these um, boxes that you can get from all these. So as you can see, you can get some starter boxes, which, well, you can basically get the starter box when you just make an account. Um, some PVM boxes, next boxes, you can also get some boss boxes, which I'm going to open two from. Mystery box wings, you can get higher tier next boxes and Zeros next boxes. Um, let me just bank one of these each. So um, yeah, let's open up these, see what we can get. And um, oh, not, of, of course, I didn't have enough space in my inventory. I only got overloads. You probably get a bunch of other items from these as well. Um, and then here you get 500,000 PVM tickets if you open one of these. And you can get Mortal Wings, Tier 4, Elite Wings, Doom Spirit Shield, Dragon Bone, Plate Legs, nothing too special there. And from these next, you just get next items basically, but you can also get Elite Next right there, like that. Um, I also got a Pure Torva Helm, which is very nice. And the Boss Mystery Box got me 100 mil cash, a Bow Sword, and a Nomadian Ring, which is actually very strong. Oh, that's very nice. And then the wings, we got Java wings. <laughs> okay, oh, that actually looks pretty nice. We also got Tormented wings, which look pretty dope as well. <coughs> My bad. 
Um, then we got black wings, which isn't too special. Lunar wings, which look pretty nice. And then we got absorption wings, which are very good because they have a high absorption rate, of course. Now we got ice um, virtus legs from the higher tier necks, and then a pure turbo helm again and ice pernex chaps. And then from the zero snacks, um, we got zero pernex cowl, zero virtus rope legs, and turbo helm zeros. And then we got a pure pernex cowl and turbo plate legs pure as well from those. So yeah, you can get some pretty nice rewards from these um, as well. And then of course you can spend these in the PVM ticket shop uh, as well. And then let me just open up five donated boxes and uh, five super donated boxes as well so you know what you can get from these now i basically got um um atrix uh virtus rope legs which is very good uh, i think oh that's just an uncommon loot it's not even that rare elite virtus rope top and then some ice uh, pernix as well i also got 10 more redeems which is pretty nice now from these super donated boxes mm -hmm. i get an illuminescence which is a common loot um virtus rope top as a regular loot uh, the Atrix version as, of course, then a red Halloween mask and a Brutal Whip Eyes as an uncommon loot as well. So yeah, we also got 15 more redeems, so that's pretty nice. Anyways, that's going to be it for this video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. Definitely make sure to enter the giveaway, and if you um, liked the video, make sure to like it and uh, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.